Well, it's the kind of thing many of us only dream of. Instead of winning the lottery, how about finding a valuable piece of art in your basement? Well, that's exactly what happened to one Alberta woman who today sold a tiny piece of history for hundreds of thousands of dollars. Ladies and gentlemen, lot 120 is next. The recently rediscovered 1913 Tom Thompson painting. Before this pint-sized painting made its way to a Toronto auction house, it was sitting in the Edmonton home of 71-year-old Glenna Gardner. But it had slack on it, so it was sort of a dull yellow sky. It wasn't for the bright, vibrant colors that it's got in there now. The retired nurse had never quite believed her father's claims that the painting of Algonquin Park was actually by the famous Canadian Tom Thompson, a man considered to be the forefather of the group of seven. She gave it to, away for a, to a friend for her 70th birthday. And then when her friend brought it, it was, this is a Thompson. Then her friend gave it back to her, and it was consigned from the original owner. Good friend, huh? After being authenticated and appraised at about $175,000, the coveted piece, measuring just 18 by 25 centimeters, made its way to Heffel Auction in Toronto, where art lovers could bid for a chance to get their hands on this little piece of Canadian history. He passed away very young, so he died in 1917, so Thompsons are rare to the market anyhow, but it's even more rare to have kind of a rediscovered Tom Thompson. 200 with Julia. 200 with Julia now. At 200,000 to 10 back with cake. But a quick bidding war would soon see the piece sold for much more. Are you bidding there, sir? We don't want underbidders remorse now. At $400,000 now. No underbidders remorse. At $400,000. Gentlemen's bid right at the back at $400,000. And I can sell at $400,000. Down it goes at $400,000 last time. With the strike of the hammer, the rare sketch was sold. The final ticket price with a buyer's premium, $481,250. The buyer chose to remain anonymous but told us he has a good-sized collection at home and this will be his first Thompson. It's a wonderful painting from 1913, and, uh, but we're very, very pleased. and We're very happy for the consigner. She's such a nice lady and she, uh, she really deserves it. And the Thompson wasn't the only artwork sold at auction tonight. There were 118 pieces up for grabs, and at least three Canadian artists broke their records for sale prices. One piece from Quebec abstract painter Paul-Emile Bourdois sold for more than $3.6 million.